Well, Pilates is really good in the early phase of my cycle, the pre uh, pre pre ovulation. Sorry, yeah, I really like uh, a good variety, and that's what that what's work that's what works for me. <laughs> Let my words out. So, but that by the time I come to moon time, I feel I feel I've done a range of exercises. I've had a good range, a variety of experiences. And I've done a, a range of things that have got my fitness up and strength and core and tone. So I've done cardio, I've done yoga, I've done Pilates, I've done walks, I've done cycling, I've done stuff in the gym. And for me, that keeps it alive. If I try and automate my exercise, I just get so bored with it and I don't want to do it. So I have to keep myself engaged with it, with variety and going with my own flow. It's taken me ages to work this out, years actually. So I thought I'd share it with you, maybe save you the pain of going through all the years of uh, not being able to work it out as, as to, yeah, as I said, this is not how I think you should do it, but really this is a guide. This is what I'm doing. This is what is working for me and I really hope it helps you to hear this and validates in some way as well the fact that uh, maybe you've been struggling as well and maybe you can't keep up a training routine. I don't know if you've heard my podcast with Uma Dinsmore Tully on uh, womb yoga and how she facilitates different phases of the cycle in a one class. I'd love that to be more widespread. I would do more yoga but um, I have found a yoga teacher here who she's not trained in womb yoga, but she's done um, pregnancy yoga and postnatal yoga. So she's in touch with uh, following our own body's lead with yoga. So I'm very much enjoying going to her classes and adjusting myself and, and she can see me adjusting and, and we work together. It's a, really a pleasant experience, actually. So, yeah, I'm very glad to have found that as well. So anyway, I hope this has been really helpful for you. I'd love to know how you exercise in tune with your cycle or or not or what you're struggling with with it. I just post in the Sacred Womb private Facebook group. The link is in the show notes. I'd really love to hear other ideas. Uh, I've tried a few apps that have said, okay, this is exercise in tune with the cycle and I'm, I don't feel them. Uh, they don't really work for me um, because they also make food suggestions and that doesn't feel quite right and yeah I think I think apps are great and all this new information that we've got access to uh, via the internet is fantastic it gives great ideas but ultimately I've just had to ignore it tune into my body experiment and find what works for me now, I know that's going to change when I go through uh, perimenopause and menopause. It might change next year. It might change when it's winter time. In fact, it does change in winter time. I go to the sauna more. I do more intense warming exercises. I love uh, twists and squeezes in yoga. So it changes through the seasons and it's just one big experiment that definitely isn't fixed and just needs to include loads of variety and tuning in for me so yes I would love to hear from you about it I think it's really helpful when we as women just talk to each other about these things and know that we're not alone there's nothing wrong with us we're not failing in any way in fact what we need to do is just listen to ourselves and follow that great oh I really enjoyed talking to you about that today. I, yeah, I'm enjoying my exercise. It's fantastic. At last, at last. Anyhow, I'll leave you there and uh, I'm looking forward to hearing from you. See you soon. I really hope you enjoyed the podcast and that you got some useful tips out of it that can make a genuine difference in your daily life. And if you'd love to work deeper with this stuff, then do head on over to thesacredwomb.com where you can sign up to receive the weekly newsletter and an invite to our private Facebook group where you can share, learn and grow with like-minded women in a safe, supported space. Thank you so much for tuning in. 
do leave us a rating and your comments are very, very welcome. And I'll see you next time.